you want to manually to draw the room, the quickest way is the rectangle drawing. Yeah. You can also use the straight wall the rectangle is more frequently being used. Just need to click and this moment you don't need to uh, holding down your left mouse button just with first click and then move your mouse yeah until you can roughly have the rectangle put at the correct position to click the second point and now you can have the basic rectangle shape of the room and then you can just click the room side of the wall for example one side of the wall here this is the thickness of the wall and then you can uh, decide on which dimension to change for example if i want to change to 120 yeah with the basic extensions it's on the onto the upper side but still there's no changing on the position the, with the inner room and if you want to change the inner area of course you can type numbers okay on the other side of the wall just next to it actually it means actually when you click the room click the walls it's adjusting about the position of this side of the wall and also it will affect the detail length okay of the other side of the wall that's the logic so you just need to type in the correct number of each side of the wall and then to get a control and then you can also uh, to cut the walls for example here using the split divide and you can type in number then to divide a side of a wall to two parts or more and also holding down this side of the wall you can change the shape with moving freely so you can just directly drag or type in the new numbers to form out the different shapes so this will be easy for you to have the uh, related uh, lines and of course you can use the reference lines in Tuki to directly type in exact number and then when you want to use the proper uh, shapes or proper positions you can also use this measure weight and also in our tool we do have the auto snap it will have a strong feeling of snapping to the boundaries whatever you finish drawing or using the reference lines it's still the same and turn to 3D you can see here we already finished one of the room drawings and you can also continue drawings and about the height you can change on the right side when you click empty area for example type in the exact numbers and that will go along with the detail height and if you want to only to see a kind of a room you can use the select rooms you can click and now only shows one of the room it will help you quite a lot to focus on some certain designs inside this kind of independent room okay and also you can turn back to select the entire room and if you want to create the multi-layer or duplicate the layers you can directly uh, click empty area and see on the right side you have new upper or new lower rooms so you can directly add up for example upper the, as the name called the second floor and also duplicate actually at this moment the system will automatically to duplicate the entire layout including the constructions so after that you can have a kind of a room called the second floor but this is not the end if you want to see the entire uh, entire layout so you can directly not only change the room height and also you can change okay or, or to have a entire view and just pay attention about the height it doesn't contain the slab thickness because if you're talking about uh, anything related to multi-layer the slab thickness will have the effect and you can click 2d to show the hidden floors for example here on the uh, left side you can also change the floor uh, opacity okay you can turn, make it fully the scene or not and also you can use this way to show the entire multi-layer and if you want to have some more connections between the uh, upper layer to 
to the lower floors, you can then turn to the floor plan to draw. For example, in 2D, you see you need to hit the hole on the second floor, okay, on the upper floor. Then turn to the floor plan, find out that floor opening, then to draw, here use rectangle or other shapes, to draw a certain area, allow that the, the connections between the upper and the lower level. So you can take a look here. That is somewhere, for example, uh, for the staircase, for some other connections. So you can do like this.